Let him in before somebody sees him. Oh, yeah. Congrats on not being dead. Oh, the day is young. Byers, you want to clue us in? We got a plane to catch. I deal with this. Said yourself we don't know the full extent of this conspiracy. We can't trust any government official. Only hope is to get on that plane. They're boarding. Then that's two problems solved. Holds clear if this thing can be trusted. What'd you do? Make it with your erector set? You're absolutely sure that this is the targeted flight? This flight was chosen primarily for its visibility. It's scheduled to pass over Manhattan on its way to Boston. You said they intend to bring this down in the middle of New York City? What if there is no bomb? What do you mean, no bomb? Langley, I need you to hack into the aircraft's onboard navigation system. We need to know where we're headed. Okay, go into headsets. I'll call on the Air Force carrier. Make them think we're sending a ground air fax. That's one twisted Star 69. I'll just get ready to ride the wave, hippie boy. Just get me on that plane and I'll get you autopilot access. And how are you going to do that? Airline telemetry systems use processors similar to those found in CB radios. I'm in. We got ourselves a convoy. What's your progress? I've hacked into the flight control system output. I'm mapping the data now. Scheduled stop in exactly 22 minutes. The corner of Liberty and Washington, Lower Manhattan. World Trade Center. We're going to crash the plane into the World Trade Center. I'll tell the flight crew. Landley, can you override the flight control system? I'm working on it. What is this? My name is Bert Byers. I work for the government. I believe this plane has been commandeered. Sir, uh, passengers are not allowed in the cockpit. I need you to return to your seat now. You don't have control of this plane, and I don't know if we can get it back. Turn off your autopilot. There may be a chance that we can override it. Uh, sir, I'll be happy to contact your superiors in the government. To sir, damn it! He's right. Try cutting electrical power. They've thought of that. They've thought of everything. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. We're experiencing some, uh, some technical difficulties up here. At this time, we'd like you all to return to your seats. And kiss your asses goodbye. Finally, we're getting close. I know, I know. New York Center. This is Atlantic National Flight 265 Heavy. We are declaring an emergency. We have 110 souls on board, 16,000 pounds of fuel, and no dangerous goods or cargo to report. <sighs> Come on, bro, Hickey. Your funds have failed, haven't they? 
There's still hope. Hope my next turn out is as nice as my last one. testimony, we can break this conspiracy wide open, bring Overlord down, the whole operation. Dan, what is it? You're a brave man, John. You're not going to testify. You're going to let them cover this up. They almost killed me twice. They won't fail a third time. My silence will keep me alive. And you? I know you and your friends are fighting for the American dream. Just don't expect to win. <laughs> 